But from trash to treasure, a local artist turns the plastic she finds on our beaches into dazzling works of art. WBZ Sarah Robleski spoke with the marine debris artist about her current exhibit in tonight's Eye on Earth report. So this, this is Hope. She is... Um, she was made for this show, so I named her Hope. Hope is an Atlantic puffin, and with a declining population, considered a vulnerable species. She's made out of zip ties and child's buckets and shovels, and there's even her eye as a, a wheel from a little toy car and um, strapping bands and... Uh, bottle top lids and all kinds of stuff. Sarah Thornington is the artist behind Hope is Not Passive, a new art exhibit made out of plastic, really garbage, that she picked up on the beach living on Cape Cod. I had so much trash that I just was horrified. And so I thought to myself, gosh, I need to do an actual project. She decided to do a beach cleanup every day for a year. I decided that I would pick up like five pieces of plastic a day. And um, after nine days, I had already picked up the equivalent of the almost 2,000 pieces that I would have picked up if I only picked up five pieces a day. So she continued to set new goals. At the end of the year, I ended up picking up almost 21,000 pieces of plastic. From there, she cleaned them, sorted them, and decided to give these little treasures a new life. So I started creating art and taking photos and having shows and just kind of, you know, trying to spread awareness in order for us to have the changes, see the changes that we want. We have to go out there and do something about it. Um, so it's, you know, hope is not passive. It's going to take all of us. In honor of Earth Month, her artwork will be on display at the Lawrence Library in Pepperell this month, but also a variety of pieces at the Shark Center in Chatham. At Atlantic White Shark Conservancy, which has both my art and images and also a collection of the debris and different things more geared towards um, families and some hands-on things. Along with her amazing artwork on display, Sarah hopes you'll also learn a little about single-use plastic and in turn be more mindful of the space and environment around us. To learn more about her work and current shows, visit our website, cbsboston.com. I'm meteorologist Sarah Robleski, WBZ News.